right, we are back. First of all, I just want to give so many internet hugs and kisses to you guys. I was really nervous about this series and the first one that I did, the one from Zara, you guys absolutely loved it. Not only did you love it, you gave me a lot of stores that I wasn't thinking of that I shop and even some that I don't shop. Um, so you guys gave me a lot of content moving forward and that is what this video is going to be about. So let's just get into today's shopping while curvy American Eagle slash Aerie. Let's get into it. What am I thinking? Let's do a quick round robin with what I have on. The shirt is from Aerie, so we'll get into that later in the video. I'm linking my hair. The hair will always be down below. It'll say like hair details. It'll have the website. I'm pretty sure my coupon code is still valid. Um, and then I'll always have the details to my press-ons. It'll say like nail details. My jewelry will always come from my shop, shoplivingfearless.com. I'll put that below. These are some new goodies that we have coming. Um, I also am dropping a silver collection. I know. Dropping a silver collection. I don't wear silver. Not at all. But you guys wear silver and apparently silver's in. So I'm dropping a silver collection. <laughs> um, so yeah, go ahead and head over there for all of those details. Is that it? I'll link this exact same makeup look is uh, one that I've already shot before. So I'll put that in the description box. What else? Yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, so American Eagle and Aerie. Um, I have personally never shopped at American Eagle before. It was one of those stores growing up I just never gravitated to and have it. I've just never, as an adult, I've just never been interested in it. I actually got introduced to Aerie um, several years ago. I was actually in Nashville and they had an, a store at the Opryland and I walked in and was obsessed with the matching sets. So much so I didn't know that Aerie was connected to American Eagle because it was nowhere near like it was a separate store and I was like I, I loved the store so I went in got several matching sets and I had been a fan with Aerie ever since um so matching sets swimwear um activewear I love their uh their panties especially when they have a good sale so that's what I have been used to shopping at for Aerie and it wasn't until probably two years ago that I realized that Aerie was connected to American Eagle even still so I wasn't going into American Eagle it was always Aerie because that was that was my lane and it wasn't until you guys were like hey can you do a uh, review on American Eagle jeans and I'm like I don't have any I better get some so I went online and I ordered three pair of jeans that we'll try on um, just to kind of get an idea of how their jeans work I also was unaware that they had a curvy collection so I did go online place an order for some jeans I also got a couple of other things including this set that I wore in San Juan that I'm obsessed with <laughs> um, so let's get into the things that I buy from there and then I try on Okay, first things first, we're going to do Aerie because that is the store. That's where I normally shop. So the number one thing I am looking at for Aerie are their matching sets, specifically in the spring and summer. I think they do a really good job with like the lightweight but kind of heavier material with the tops and the shorts. I, I'll pull up, I have a black set, this one actually right here. I've had this for years, but they always bring some version of it back around. So I did get this, I got the top and a large, and I got the bottoms and a large, and I just love the way these sets look. I also do have this set in gray, and I have this set in white, because I just love these. I, I like it that you guys know anytime when you're in doubt and you want to look put together but you're unsure what to wear, put on a matching set. Matching set will elevate anything even if it looks very basic like this black set. Um, so I've had these three colors for years. I love that I can dress them up with some nice, you know, embellished I was gonna say heels but y'all know I'm not wearing heels with some nice embellished sandals and a cute bag and I can dress it down with some sneakers and a ball cap I love just the many different ways that I can wear this um next up and I I have one here this is a pair of black ones and then I have um I'll pull out the black ones and I have oh let's do these these are so they have um really good ribbed biker shorts one of the things that I love about Aerie is their shorts don't ride. And y'all see my thighs, okay? Thighs be 
thighs in, exactly. And so I like it. I really like to wear biker shorts when I'm, you know, just like out running errands. I want to put an oversized shirt. Or sometimes um, when I am out hiking, I like to hike with biker shorts on. Biker shorts, sh you know, socks, uh, hiking boots. I like to wear the ones from Aerie because I know that they're not going to ride. And they actually hit at a at a length I'm pretty comfortable with. And I, like I said, I don't have to worry about them riding. I love these. I had these before pregnancy, or when I tell you that they have lasted before, during, and after pregnancy. I'll pop up a video that I posted or that I have with me being very heavily pregnant and it like stretched. But I like that even though it stretches, it doesn't like stretch out. It still comes, it still goes back to like its normal waist area so love their ribbed their rib section stellar i have ribbed shorts i have <laughs> ribbed um leggings my only caveat with the leggings is most of them don't have pockets and so in that case i don't work out in them because i need pockets when i work out i need to put you know carmex in one pocket because my lips will get chapped i need to put my phone in my other pocket so i like to have pockets when i work out especially when i'm going to the gym but i like to wear these like out and about lounging running errands that kind of stuff because the ribbed is stellar i did pick these up so i did tell you that i just made a purchase um but i did pick these up because they had a sale on their um Think on the whole website so i picked these up these are offline both of these are offline by airy um so i did pick these up i like the fold over and i don't know what this material is but um it is making sis look like she ain't got no stomach and i yeah i know y'all think i ain't got one i do i just i dress pretty well in order to hide it but what's left sis it's it's sucking your girl in, which I definitely appreciate. Like I said, this is the Real Me 7 8 High Rise Leggings. And I did get these in a large. So love, 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 love their like active wear collection. All right. And so those are all the normal things that I buy. I did buy this matching set. I'll put it up here. Um, once again, it's a matching set from Aerie. I actually got it because it is like a crochet. So it is um kind of see-through but then kind of not because you can't really tell what color bra i have on but it's definitely breathable and so that's what i love i did wear it in san juan with me and the family went down there and even though it is a little like a thick crochet because it was you know holy it's it was breathable so i didn't feel like hot and it was about 75 to 80 degrees no about 75 degrees in san juan and the between the wind and the holes in the crochet i felt breathe very breathable so i did get the top and the bottom and a i want to say i got this in an extra large yes i got this in an extra large and then i got this in a medium because you guys know i'm a little i'm a lot heavier down below than i am up top so that's all the stuff that i normally get from airy also the panties but i think they go without saying i just like their panties i'll link the two different uh types that i buy and of course you know i'm buying them in black and they're in large so that's what i normally buy from airy the new stuff that i got i only got one new item from airy and then the rest of the jeans are from american eagle and the only thing that i got new is this offline by airy it's just you would think it's just a basic white crop shirt but then when i saw this heavy like thick band i was like tell me more so i did try it on i think what i like is i I love a cropped but I don't like sometimes when crops like don't stay cropped and they turn from a crop shirt to a bra like I don't I don't need you to rise that much like I don't I'm not trying to show everything that I have <laughs> um, so I do like that this has a little bit of a band so it's a little staying power and then because the band is a little tight it kind of hugs your girl in I which I definitely appreciate I did get a large and what I will say is that I this is a little big so I like the the band but I feel like if I went one size down the band would be even more like I feel like it would suck the area the waist in especially the the, the back fat back here I feel like it would suck that in so I do have a large but I still have the tag on it so I am going to take it back um, and get a medium I didn't know we had an airy store in Birmingham 
apparently it just opened up well not just opened up but not too long opened up at the summit so i'm going to take this back to the one at the summit and hopefully they have it so i can get a uh, medium if not i'll just return it and then buy the medium online like i did last time so absolutely love this cropped thing i didn't want to try it on again i did try it on when i got it because i didn't have on makeup but for the purposes of this video i did not try it on because i have on a full face of makeup and i hate when people take stuff back and there's like makeup on here someone has worked in retail like there was there's makeup all on the collar and i'm like did you try it on and did you wear it <laughs> So I don't want to get anything on it. So I'm not going to try it on for this video. But um, for reference, I am going to take this back and get a medium because I kind of want it to be a little bit more on the waist. Okay, now let's get into the jeans. I ordered three pair of jeans and I really ordered three pair. I ordered some sizes, some different washes, some different styles just so I can get an idea of what their sizing looks like. Like I said before, I didn't know, I did not know that American Eagle had a curvy collection. So I, for reference, I'm between a 10 and a 12. I put my measurements um, in the description box at Zara. I'll put my updated measurements now because she's losing weight. <laughs> Um, anyways, I'm in between a 10 and a 12. I went ahead and got a 12, um, just so that I can make sure that I can wear them. Um, so I got a 12 in the curvy collection. I got a 12 in a mom jean collection. And then I got a 14 in their regular size because I did go online and see some of the reviews that the straight jeans and non curvy, they run small. So we'll get into my least favorite up until my absolute favorite. I am obsessed with these jeans. I'm definitely going to buy these jeans in another wash. Okay, getting into it. These are the um, mom jean straight. Um, these are in a size 12. Uh, so I got these. The only reason why these are not my second favorite is because of this. And you couldn't see this. I'm going to pop up the model. I couldn't see that. I thought, and this is just me, maybe this is me being ignorant. I thought that was just her skin because you can tell she's Caucasian. The hole looks like that's her skin. So I was like, oh, okay, so they're holy jeans. And that's what I was looking for. I really wanted some distressed jeans because I had been on a kick of buying jeans that didn't have holes in them. Then when I looked up, I'm like, I'm feeling grungy, but I don't have any grungy jeans. So I wanted to get some that were holy. I, I didn't want this fabric. What What is this? What? Where are we? So I'm either going to get take them back or I'm just going to cut it out. Let me see. Oh yeah, it's a patch. I'm just going to cut it out. This is a patch because I actually really like the jean. I just absolutely hate this fabric. When I say I'm going to cut it out, I'm going to get my mom to do it because, you know, I, I know my ministry and that's not it. So I, once I do love the jeans, they are mom jeans. So most of the time mom jeans are a little bit more laxed in the thigh area anyway, thigh waist area. I do love that these sipped your girl up. I do. Okay. You, did you see that stomach? Exactly. Because it ain't there in these jeans. Um, Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely love uh these jeans i guess they're my second favorite now so i move them now that i know i can take the fabric out i'm moving them from third to second place uh like i said i did get a 12 regular i just like that these look i also like that with these jeans surprisingly i the 12 i didn't have to I don't think I'll have to take anything in the waist. Um, maybe an inch or two as I'm starting to lose weight and get back down to my pre-COVID weight. But right now, I love that I didn't have to do any kind of alterations on these jeans. So, love these. Um, at the time when I bought them, they were regularly $70 or $69.95. And I got them on sale for $45.21. So, these are now the second favorite jeans. All right, what is now my third favorite <laughs> pair of jeans are these cream, I would say cream slash off-white, and I got these, so these are the ripped high-waist baggy, baggy, baggy straight jeans. So these are the jeans that are the, the non-curvy jean. Got them in destroyed white. I got these in a 14 regular. I'm going to sit over here so you guys can see. And I'm in a 14, so a whole size up. Can you see how tight these jeans are? In the, in the thighs. And that's why I love the curvy collection on a lot of 
places is because they do more emphasis in the thigh area. I don't, the waist ain't a problem for uh, some curvy girls. It's the, we have to buy up to be able to fit our hips and our thighs. And then our waist is like, well, what about us? So I did get these in a 14, as you guys can clearly tell, they are big in the waist. Um, they are tight in the thigh area. This was my first time, well, my second time technically trying them on. I just wanted to make sure that they would fit for the purposes of the video. I have not worn them out. Um, so I'm assuming that as I wear them throughout the day, they will get relaxed on me. Um, the material makeup on these are ugh, cotton. 95% cotton and then 5% elastic cotton. Thanks. And then the waistband is 94% cotton, 5% recycled cotton, and 1% elastane. So cotton, 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 cotton. So what that does tell me is cotton has a tendency to stretch. So once I put the jeans on and I wear them for probably for the day, they will stretch to an area that I am comfortable with. And then from then on, I'm just going to have to dry clean. Dry cleaning is getting expensive. I just want to let you guys know that. Like I know it's like, oh, I'm always the dry cleaner. Dry cleaning is expensive, but it's something that I choose to do because one, I want to take care of my clothing especially $50 pairs of jeans I'm sorry that's a lot of money for for me right now for a pair of jeans especially when I'm losing weight and I might have to do this shit all over again in six months from now so I want to make sure that I'm taking better care of the jeans and also I don't want to have to be uncomfortable for another three to four hours when I put these jeans on because that's that's what I'm going to be these jeans are going to be uncomfortable for three to four hours until the cotton stretches and then I'll be fine so love I love the style of these jeans I love um the kind of beige threading that they have in them um I love the hole at the ankle I love the way that they stop I even like the distressed at the bottom down here like I love the distress look so it's not so um, uniform I love that I just didn't like the fact that I purposely went a size up to a 14 and they're still tight in the waist meanwhile my waist is like no they're still tight in the thighs and my waist is like we need some help so I have these I am going to probably take them um, I was taking them to the alterations place but now that my mom has a sewing machine, I've been taking my clothes to my mom. I'm sorry. My mom was a seamstress for 10 years of her life. And now that she has the proper sewing equipment, she's now my seamstress. Because my seamstress went up on these prices because the inflation. I'm like, sis, is this inflation or are you doubling the price? Like, ooh. So I've just been taking these to my mom. And it's great because then I get same day service. I ignore her until she does it. Okay. All right, and so let's get into the last pair, my favorite pair. Okay, my favorite pair of jeans, I can't pull them up because I actually have them on because I'm obsessed with them, so I'm going to pop them up here. And these are the uh, Strigid Ripped Curvy Super High Waisted Baggy Wide Leg Jeans. I got these in a size 12, and I love them. So their Curvy Collection stellar love that i will probably moving forward only buy from their curvy collection because i know what i'm getting i know if i buy a curvy and i buy a 12 i probably to be honest probably could have bought a 10 because as i am sitting and this is probably this is my third time wearing them i wore them just out with william i wore them to book club this past um sunday and i'm wearing them now um so i probably will well i could get them taken in right now um but I'm probably going to wait until I lose a little, a little bit more weight and have my mom take them in. So I probably could have gotten a 10. But I love that I put these jeans on and they immediately fit. I didn't have to worry about the thighs being too tight. I didn't have to worry about the waist being too big. They just fit. What I tell you that these jeans fit like butter. It's like butter. I absolutely love these jeans. Absolutely love these jeans. So, uh, the verdicts in American Eagle curvy, yes. The other washes, I can't say. Some fit, some don't. Some you gotta get your size. Some size you have to go up. But as far as their curvy collection fits, 
you should be okay getting your size and for that i'm forever grateful i love that these jeans because i've always wanted a pair of like baggy jeans in the thighs i can't remember ever being able to get a pair of baggy jeans in the thighs in my size normally i have to go up two or three sizes just for the thighs to be baggy and then get the waist taken in and have my seamstress yell at me like sis why are you buying these big ass jeans so for me to be able to find jeans that are baggy in the thighs in my size it makes me so happy like it makes me so happy like my heart is just it makes me so happy that's all i can say so for an extent on the jeans curvy c some of the other ones i see i see all right and so guys that is the end of this video i hope you guys have enjoyed this um enlightening video like i said i had never shopped at american eagle before so i got some jeans for you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed it i will put because these this everything on here is very recently like but not by this <laughs> when i say that this is so recent uh april the 10th okay april the 10th so this is definitely very recent so i'll make sure to be able to link i won't be able to link this black set because like i said i've had this for years but i will link a couple of other airy matching sets that are so good um but everything else i'll be able to link directly to you i'll make sure if i didn't put it here in the description box i am going to put the sizes so that you have a reference of how things fit for your body type so if you have reached this part in the video, you have not subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe. Also click the notification bell so you don't miss any videos from me. If there is a store that you want me to do a shopping route curvy series on, please leave it in the comment section below. I have two other ones that I'm thinking about doing and I've never shopped them before. So I'm kind of excited to see. I'm excited to find new stores. Like I, I love H&M, I love a, you know, a Zara, but I'm, I'm excited to find different stores that I normally would have never found had it not been for you guys. So please leave it in the comment section below. Um, while you're here guys, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and do all the things that the other YouTubers tell you to do, and I'm going to catch you guys Thursday, 7 o'clock. Later.